And today I thought I would do a video that is an update of my Monster High and Ever After High collection and you know all the vinyls and minis and sets that are included. So here are the shelves of dolls. So my collection has gotten a bit smaller and changed up quite a bit since my last video because I have donated some dolls and given some away and I will be selling some of them for pretty low prices on my eBay account so I'll post that soon and I'll give you guys a link to there but anyway I just wanted to show you guys what I have and now so let's get started I'm gonna start off with the top shelf so I have all of my vinyls here now I haven't gotten new vinyls in a while I want to get just enough to fill up the shelf Okay, and then here I have the Spring Unsprung dolls, so now my Ever After High dolls sit right with my Monster High dolls. So here is all of the girls. And Spring Unsprung is probably one of my favorite Ever After High lines. And then here are my custom dolls. So I could not fit all of them on this shelf because I have customized so many dolls over the years so I'm gonna try to show you them from up here you know what I'll just slide them out of the way so you can see the others so yeah there's a couple more back there if you guys want to see a full separate video just showing you my custom dolls and I could talk about a little bit how I made some of them then request it in the comments below and I will try to do that Okay, so going on to the next shelf. Here I have some play sets and some dolls sitting down in front. So I kept very few dolls of the reboot because I don't know if you guys knew, but I am not as big a fan of the reboot as I was of the older dolls because the older dolls were just so much more detailed and like fancy in my opinion. So I think these are the only two of the new ones that I kept. Oh, and of course, some of the Ghoul's Beast pet dolls. So here's the Laguna with the scooter, Casket Ball Venus. Then here I have some other mixed dolls. There's Coffin Bean Abby, Scaremaster Katrine, Freaky Field Trip Torlai, Dance Class Rebecca. Um, I forgot the line that that scare is in, <laughs> sorry. Then there's Sweet Screams Ghoulia. Um, then that's the Claudine from the Werewolf Sister 2 pack where she came with the very original Halloween. And then here's Roller Maze Claudine. I'm sorry if you couldn't see their shoes when I first showed them. Right, and then in the back we have some play sets. So here I have kind of like a birthday party scene going on. And I have just some more mixed dolls here and that is the original Melody Piper. I just changed her up a bit. Then we have the Scarus playset, and I have all the Scarus dolls that I kept hanging out around here. And then here is Birthday Ball Duchess and two of the Ghoul's Beast pet dolls, Cleo and Laguna. Alright, that is it for this shelf. Then going down, this is probably my favorite shelf because it has all of the original dolls on it. And none of these are the re-releases, these are all the very first releases. And there's my custom slow-mo. And I lost my original deuce like a couple years ago. So I just have the deuce from the Manster's 2 pack here now, just so Cleo is not alone. And then that's everybody. And there are some pets down here too. It's just all kinds of pets, not even necessarily the pets that they came with just because I've acquired so many pets. Oh, Operetta Spider fell over. <laughs> okay, I'll pick him up later. Now I will show you guys these dolls that are sitting down in the front. These are the Freak Do Chic Ghouls, and these is probably one of my favorite lines of Monster High because they're so beautiful. Then we have Dawn of the Dance, and I'm going to be selling my Cleo just as a separate doll so I gave her outfit to Claudine and I think this is the um, Ghoul's Beast Pet Claudine that came with the salon but I'm not sure guys so I might have forgotten that 
and I love that Goulia. That Goulia is probably one of my favorites. And this Frankie right here was one of my original dolls. Yeah, and all of these, like this corner right here, these were some of my earliest dolls that I ever got. Then we have the Dead Tired line, so this is another one of the very original lines of Monster High. And I made a custom Howleen Dead Tired doll right here. And then I'm just going to show you guys their shoes now. Because I am filming with my phone, so I cannot get them all in the camera at once. Alright, then going down I have some Ever After High and the rest of my Monster High basic dolls. So here are some of the slightly newer ones like LED and Easy Dawn Dancer. And then I somehow ended up with very few Ever After High dolls, but I got to keep my favorites like Rosabella and Justine and Briar. Alright, then on the final shelf, I have some play sets and the minis. So I guess I'll start with the minis since they are right in front of my face. So here are the originals. These are the very original minis and unfortunately I could not get all of them because my stores didn't have the minis until it was like the second or third wave was already coming out. And then here are the circus ghouls. Then we have the dead tired ones, or the sleepover ghouls. I'm sorry, I forgot what they're called. Then the candy ghouls, which are so sparkly. And I even have the Frankie, which is from the season two minis. Then we have the ghosts. And I have all of the ghost ghouls, because they are so pretty. And then going on to the top row, we have the Power Ghouls, I think that's what they're called, it's the superhero ones. Then the Space Monsters, and I got a deuce that kind of has wonky glasses, so he's really cute. Then I have Pattern Ghouls, which is one of my favorite lines because I really love the prints that they did. Especially Rochelle's prints, I think she's really cute like that. And then here are some of the newer ones that I got in the three packs, like Electrified Ari, the Mermaid Laguna, I think this is Fruity Venus, and then the Geek Shriek Twyla, which is so cute. All right, then I have some dolls over here in play sets, and these furniture pieces are either from Ever After High play sets or the Monster High High School so I combined and took apart some play sets to make this. So here are the final group of dolls. I have Way to Wonderland Raven, Epic Winter Rosabella, who is the only Epic Winter doll I kept. Then I have one of the dolls from the Monster Maker. I named her Scarlet Rose. And of course, Nefra from Boo York. I love her so much. She's, she just has the most beautiful hair ever. Like, I wish that was my hair. If I were to make my hair any color or style, it would definitely be like Boo York Nefra's. Okay, and then I used some game pieces from the Manster's 2-pack to create this display for my custom Rebecca and Laguna. And I think that's Roller Maze Laguna, but I forgot which Rebecca that is. Sorry guys. If you guys can guess who some of the customs are, then that would be really cool. So you guys can try and guess in the comments. Right, then here's my final playset, which is the glass slipper, and I have all kinds of different shoes here. I think that only one pair actually came with the set, I just added the rest. And here I have my picture day dolls, Operetta, and Frankie. Okay guys, so that is it for my collection video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching. And I cannot wait for my collection to change and grow and to do another video probably next year or maybe within the next couple of months. Great, so once again, thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoy the slideshow. Bye.